Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a great band workout for you. So if you have a band laying around or anything that you can use like a band, you just need some resistance, uh, go grab it. Um, this can be done anywhere. As you can see, I am outdoors. I will be using this bench. Um, at home, you can wrap your band around a table, dresser, anything that can withstand your weight because we will be pulling on that band. So come up and join me. Um, and then let's just get this workout going. All right, you guys, what I want you to do is um, make your band even on both sides like I have mine. What we're gonna start off with is very simple bicep curls. So twist, I want you to pull back, step back a little bit, make sure you have some resistance on that band for yourself. Palms are up and all we're gonna do is we're just gonna curl all the way up and then curl down. Now I don't want you to down on the side. I want you to be up on an angle like you see how I am. And so we're gonna curl up and we're gonna go right back down to straight arm right here, keeping our palms up throughout this exercise. Now I am standing up nice and tall. My stomach's in tight, engaging those abs. The only thing that is moving is I'm bending my elbows right here straight. Keep those arms up on that angle. Make sure not to bring them down next to you. Alright you guys, we're going to do four more of these and we're going to move to the next exercise. That's four. This is three. Two. One more. And one. Nice. Now the next thing I want you to do is put your band together. Alright? And I'm going to double hold on. I have uh, handles on mine. If you don't, just hold yours like this, double fisting it. I'm going to hold mine right here. I'm going to step back just a little bit more. I'm going to bring this to my chest. My elbows are up like this. But when you're in this position, don't go, don't shrug your shoulders up. You want to keep those shoulders nice and relaxed. All you're doing is moving your elbows up. So don't go like this. If you're feeling like you're kind of scrunched up here, relax. Just take a deep breath in and relax your shoulders. I want you to concentrate on the muscles we're working. Going down and then up. Remember, you want to pull that band the whole time. Ooh, I almost fell backwards. You want to pull this band the whole time towards your chest. And just hold it there while you're coming up going down all right you guys we have four more so this is four squeeze those cheeks behind you when you stand up three two last one and one nice job guys all right now what I'm gonna have you do is I want you to loosen up the one side so you see how this one's like nice and loose this one's longer that's what I want you to do so face me um, we're going to do a side shoulder raise. Actually, that's a little too loose for me, so I'm going to tighten that up. So one, this one is just hanging out. We're really not pulling on it. We're not doing nothing with it. We're just holding it there. And this other one's going to go right here. Palm's going to face the um, towards whatever you have your band on. Okay, so in my case, my palm is facing towards this bench. What I'm going to do is I'm going to lift it up right there and then I'm going to bring it right back down. I am not going like this. I don't want to super loosen this up so I'm going to keep it nice and tight throughout. So I'm probably going to stop midway through my um, thigh here and lift up. Now I am lifting up just a little bit more than my shoulder. Not too much more so I don't want you way up here. Just a little bit controlling that movement. So it's just a little, so here's a T. Just want you to go a little bit more than a T. Right like that. Nice job. Great job, guys. Keep it up. All right, we have four more. Four. Ooh, I am feeling this one. Three. Two. Last one and one nice job guys all right you got to do the other side so excuse you are going to get a back view of me so hold this one nice and loose remember don't pull on it and here we go we're going to go across and you should be going across your body you want to lift up a little bit more than that teeth not 
too much, but just enough. Nice job guys. Now what we are going to do, um, oops, we're going to face the bench or dresser or table, whatever you got. What we're going to do is I'm going to do a back lunge. So my feet are going to be together. I want this to be nice and tight. So right now I can feel pressure because my palms are facing backwards and I'm pulling this. So it should be in a pull uh, motion every time. Um, throughout this exercise. What we're going to do is we're going to do a back lunge. So we're going to sit back. This is going to pull more. And then we're going to go right back. We're going to alternate with that back lunge, pulling that band behind us. Nice and tight. Pull it. Alternating those legs. Step way back when you do those back lunges. Protecting those knees. Protecting that hip. Don't go short like this, okay? You really want to step back. Pulling that band, whatever you have. Palms are facing backwards. All right, we have four more. Four, three, two, last one, and one. Nice job, guys. All right, now what I'm gonna have you do is I want you to hold it again like this. So I'm holding both of my handles. If you don't have a handle, just hold it right like this, whichever works for you. All right, so we're gonna hold it right here. Make sure it's centered in your body so I have it even with the middle of my body. And we're just gonna twist to the opposite side. Now your stomach has to be nice and tight for this one, really engaging those abs. Toes are facing forward. We're just twisting to that side, twist twist. My hip is uh, slightly forward, engaging those abs as tight as I can. Make sure you breathe. You want to exhale here. I'm going to breathe in. All right, we have four more. Four, three, two, and one. Nice job, guys. All right, I'm going to turn my back to you. We're going to do the same thing. Have that centered in, um, in the center of your stomach. And here we go. Twist to the opposite side. Twisting. Stomach is tight. My hips are slightly forward. Abs are engaged. I'm just twisting outward. Oh, I feel these. I love this one. I can really feel my whole core working. Alright, we have four more. Four. Three. Two. Last one. And one. Nice job, guys. All right, let's start from the beginning. We're going to do round two. All right, we're going to start with those bicep curls. So step back for me. Legs are apart, always supporting that back and that spine and hip area. Stomach's nice and engaged. Have your hands on an angle, palms facing up, and let's do those curls. Curl it up, bring it right back down. You want to make sure this is really nice and tight for you. Give yourself a good workout. Now, if you're not able to stand, um, you know, the distance I am, that's okay. If this is where you are, this works too. Or if the band is just too much for you, by all means, just do this. Just keep your arms out on an angle. This works just as well. The thing, the thing is, you're still moving. You're still giving yourself that good workout that your body needs. So don't worry. If you can't do the band, it's all good. As long as you keep moving and give whatever your 100% is. All right, you guys, we have one more. Nice. All right, now we're going to do that one. We're going to hold it together. I want you to pull it towards your chest. Your arms are going to go upright like this. All right. Remember, um, with this one, don't shrug the shoulders. You want to make sure they're nice and relaxed, that you're just lifting um, up the elbows and not doing that, all right? So bring that to your chest. We're gonna do squats. Open up your legs. Bring this right here. Elbows are up, the shoulders are down. Here we go. Squat it down, bring it up, squeezing 
those cheeks behind you, squeeze that butt, tush, backside, whatever you call it. Squeeze it right there when you come up. Stomach's in nice and tight. My chest stays up, if you notice. I am not bending forward. I'm just squatting down. Nice job, guys. Keep it going. All right, we have four more. Hang in there. Four. Ooh, the wind's blowing me. Three. Two. Give me one more. Nice. All right, you guys. Now we're going to do that one where we're going to lift up the side here. So relax one side of your band. This one's going to go right here. I like to start it in front of my thigh. All right, we're going to lift up right here and then down. Making sure those abs are nice and tight. I know I'm like a broken record, guys, but I want to make sure you have good form throughout. It's always good to have that friendly reminder. I know myself, I have a bad habit of letting my stomach disengage. We want to keep that nice and tight. All right, we have four more. Four. Remember, you're not lifting that arm up too high. Three, two, one more. And one, nice. All right, let's do that other side. All right, nice and loose. We might have done that little two boost. All right, and here we go. Lift it up and down. Our palms are going to be down. We're going to do those alternating back lunges. Stomach's in nice and tight. Palms are backwards. Make sure it's nice and tight first. All right, and here we go. Back, forward. I'm going to scoot over because I have the pad to help me. I think that through when I was doing these back lunges. <laughs> Make sure to step all the way back. Pull on that band. Give it that extra pull. Really working those triceps, which is the back of that arm while you're going down. It's that back lunge. Remember when lunging, really step back nice and deep, keeping that torso up. And now, if the band is too much, just simply do back lunges. And if you can, push those arms back. This works just as well. Just keep moving. Ooh. Nice job, guys. Woo, I am proud of you. All right, we're gonna do those twists now. So hold the band right here. Again, don't shrug those shoulders. Keep them nice and relaxed. Stomach's in tight. Here we go. Twist outward and then right back forward. Twist. So basically what I want you to do is I want you to twist to where that elbow meets me. Right there. Again, if having the band is too much for you, why don't you just write like this, holding your hands together, however the heck you want to hold your hands, and give me that elbow, still twisting side to side, right here. Works just as good. Give me one more. Nice job, guys. Let's do that other side. Excuse the back view. All right, hold it in the middle of you, and then here we go. Twist. Make sure that stomach's in nice and tight. Woo! Twisting side to side. Itch that band if you need to. If you have a bad back, I would suggest you to ditch the band. Are we have four more. Four, three, two, last one, and one. Nice job, guys. All right, we are on to round three. We can do this. All right, here we go. You should know the drill by now. Face it. Lift up those arms, palms are up. Give me those bicep curls. Curl it, and then down. Curl, and then down. Stomach's in nice and tight. Hips are forward. Don't forget to breathe for me, people. Breathe out, bringing it up. Breathe 
breathe in going down. All right, we have four more. Four, three, two, last one, one. Nice job, guys. All right, we're gonna bring it to us. We're gonna do those squats. Remember, I want you to pull it tight. Don't shrug up those shoulders. Keep them nice and relaxed. Pull this towards you. Have it nice and tight. Toes are forward. Sit back on that chair. Pretend you're sitting back. Stand it up. Squeeze those cheeks. Squeeze the butt cheeks. Backside, your tush, whatever it is you call it. And bring it down. Bring it up. Constantly pulling that band. Now, obviously, you do not need to do this with the band. You can easily ditch it and just give me those squats right here. Squat just nice and deep, how far you can go. If this is all you got, this works too. All right, but give me one more. Nice job, guys. All right, let's do those side, side lifts. I'm gonna loosen this band just a little bit. Have that nice and tight next to that thigh. Remember, don't over loose it. Make it tight. Here we go. Lift it up and then down. Lift it up and down. I apologize if there's a lot of wind. Hopefully, um, the beats I have uh, are canceling out the wind. If it is not, I apologize for that. It's a lot windier out here than I thought it was going to be. You should see how I have my uh, tripod rigged so it does not blow down. So far, it's working, so that's awesome. All right, you guys, we have four more. Four. Stomach in nice and tight. Three. Two. Last one. One. Nice job, guys. All right. Loosen that other one. Remember, it's just So I still want you to stop right here and I want you to lift it up. All right, as high as you can go. Stomach's in tight. One more for me. Nice job, guys. All right, we're gonna do those alternating back lunges. All right, so have that nice and tight right here. And then let's alternate back lunge. I'm gonna scoot over because I'm hitting that path. Nice. Step back. Oops, hold it here. I did bad. I was releasing it. Don't release it. Keep it nice and tight. Right here next to your legs. Push it extra when you step back. My bad. I was messing that up. <laughs> nice job, guys. All right, for those of you who can't do the band, that's cool. Just continue to do those back lunges for me and push it back. Oops. Shaky, shaky, if the camera is moving. Four more, four, three, watch those shoulders, make sure they're relaxed. Two, last one, and one. Other side, here we go, twist. One, nine, stomach's in tight, hips are forward. I got sweat dripping down. Ooh, this is a good workout. Thanks again for joining me. Don't forget to give me thumbs up if you like this video. If you haven't yet, please subscribe. It helps me out tremendously. One more twist. Nice. All right. You guys, we did it. Awesome, awesome job. All right. Let's, uh, it's time to stretch. Time to cool.
pull down and stretch. Hold on to something if you need to. We're doing knee and knee. If not, what also helps is having your arm up or in front of you. Or if you're like me, you can just stand here and hold it. Whatever works. And release. Other side. Also a thing that also works if you have a hard time getting that leg up, you can always put it on something right like this. That will work as well. And release. Nice. Alright you guys, one leg back, the other one is forward. Bend that knee, go towards the front. Uh, my back, I am my heel is up, I'm up on my toes, and just hold it. Straighten that front leg and I want you to go down if you can and hold. Put that hand, the front leg and the arm right here, twist up, open up, look back up at that hand if you can. If not, just look forward. Bring that back down. give me a thumbs up uh, hit subscribe don't forget to hit that bell icon that will notify you when I post upload a new workout and once again peace out from Illinois bye guys